Backup Exec 21 allows us to duplicate our jobs, which is really useful, and I've actually used it in my consulting practice. So what we would do is we would back up to a storage device, say, for instance, that's on-premises, and then if I plugged in a USB drive that I could then take off-site, then I could do that as well, and then I'd have it both on-site as well as off-site. I can also duplicate it to a cloud as well. So I'm going to choose this particular server. And instead of choosing jobs, I'm going to go down to where it says backup sets on the left hand side. So select backup sets and we see each of our different backup sets. And all a backup set is is a division of different types of backup. So for instance, my entire C drive is a backup set. And the EFI system partition and the system state, they're all separate backup sets. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight my snapshot of my C drive and I'm going to right click and I'm going to choose duplicate and I'll get this new wizard. Now if I choose run now, obviously it's gonna run now. Otherwise, I could choose to run at a specific time or create without a schedule and schedule this later. Now under storage, I'm going to choose my other device. So say this is my internal and this is my USB device, I would just select my USB device. I can also choose my cloud storage as well. So if I want to duplicate the cloud storage that has to be set up ahead of time and I have a separate video for that in the playlist you can check out. I'm going to choose my other storage device. You can choose compression and encryption if you have that set up. I like to uncheck the verify just because it takes twice as long with it and I can verify it myself manually. And when it's all set I can click OK and now my duplicate job is going to go ahead and start running and it's going to back up to that other device. So that's how you duplicate storage either to the cloud or to another device such as a USB drive in Backup Exec 21 and it works in older versions as well.